Hi everybody, welcome back to another tutorial C++. Today uh, I'm going to show you how to use if statement. And this program will test two team scores. The user will be asked to enter a score for his or her team. And based on the if statement, you will compare the two scores. Alright, so let's get started. So first let's create a new project. So click project here and go to console. Choose C++, next and write if statement here and click next finished open source open main.cpp and uh, delete all this all right so every c++ program start with pound include iostream this is the input and output file all right so and then it says using namespace standard file std all right, so now you have to create a main function int int main open parenthesis close it and brace all right first at the fifa world cup 2014 final is tomorrow july 13 2014 all right so the team is argentina this is germany so first variable is called int and is argent argentina argentina score all right now the second variable is Germany, so Germany score. All right. So now C out. I let the user. So tomorrow, tomorrow is the is the FIFA 2014 World Cup between our Argentina. This is. Germany all right that and end line this is end line all right so let me clear the next line so backslash n come on backslash n all right first I will let the Argentina fans to enter a, a desk score so see out so inside here and Argentina fans please enter a score all right that end line all right see in console inputs and this is called the Argentina is the variable you just created up here Argentina score all right so now let's go to see out now uh, I want the Germany Germany fans, please enter a score. All right, end, end, end line. Now see in. Now this is the Germany. This is the Germany score. All right. All right. So let me just clear the next line. So backslash and to have some good reading and good space. All right. Now, I'm going to create my if statement to compare the two scores. So if, if Argentina, if Argentina's score is greater than Germany, Germany's score, then C out, console output, C out, Argent, Argentina, Argentina, won the world. The World Cup 2014 all right that's the first that's the first condition the second condition agent if if the argent if Argentina if Argentina score is less than Germany score then see out Germany G Germany won the World Cup 2014 all right and line I like to put space here I like to put space on this space here and space here okay go back here space here all right so now 
this is this the th now the third condition is uh, if if Argentina if Argentina score is equal to Germany so and then there's a tie Germany score right then there's a tie C out oh. there is a tie one one team need to win all right so there's a tie one team need to win. now I want to tell the you tell the user to enter a new score so see out please Germany fan enter a score all right since there's a tie so don't forget that I'm blind all right so see in Germany score All right, now if there's a tie, so and so now let's compare that. If uh, let me just copy this to be very quick, so I don't want this video to be too long. If Argentina score is greater than uh, Germany score, then see out Argentina team. Argentina team won the won the World Cup. Okay, World Cup. There's there is there's their score is now. Let me prompt the score of Argentina. So let me just copy Argentina and here and end line. All right, now. If now the Argentina, if the Germany score now, if the Germany score is greater than Argentina score, see out now you know, and Germany team won the World Cup. Their score is now uh, uh, Germany. Uh, Here is Germany. Germany. All right. End line. All right. Now the third condition: if the Argentina score is equal to the Germany score. Then there's a tie. See out. Sorry, uh, I need this. See out. There is, there is a tie again. All right. There is a tie again. Over time, over time to play. All right. So let me close this end line, and let me just close uh, clear clear the next line so I can read it very great. All right. So now let's go out here. The if so so this is out the first if statement. So this is we go out now the scope, and now the f now the final the final score is res res respectively. Respectively, now I want to put uh, respectively. Now this is gonna be the Argentina score, and uh, and here is gonna be the Germany Germany score and line. All right, so basically we done. So first condition if the Arge Argentina if the Argentina oh Tina if the Argentina team a score is greater than two, the Argentina won if the Argentina score is less than Germany then the Germany team won 
if the score are tied then there's a tie then i let the user enter the german score if the that argentina score is greater again than the germany score then argentina win if the argent germany score is greater than argentina's score then the Ger germany win won the cup if not instead there's a tie now they have to play over time and i will display the final all right so like control s and let's run this Okay, Argent, Argentina. Okay, this is should be Tina. All right, there's an error here. It should be Tina. Okay, let's run this. R, oh, R, this is the R. Let's run this. All right, so Argent, tomorrow is the FIFA World Cup between Argentina and Germany. Argentina fan, please enter a number. So Argentina score four goal. And Germany fan, please enter a number. And three. Then Argentina won. Argentina won, the, and the score is four three. Now let's click this. If Argentina win three and uh, Germany four, then Germany won. Oh, good. Now if there's a tie, three three, then there's a tie. So I put four. Then the Germ then the Germany team won the World Cup. Okay, and then uh, respectively three for Argentina, three four for um, uh, Germany. All right. So. Um, I hope uh hi okay so hope this tutorial was not too long and if you have any comment please leave below and it was fun and uh, this is how you use if statement to compare two scores all right so thanks for watching and uh, please don't forget to subscribe thank you and bye